Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm Chris. And I'm Lara. And today we're reacting to... The Boondog Season 1, Episode 8, The Real. Now guys, before we get to this video, please give this video a thumbs up. And also comment down below what videos you want us to react to next as we'll get to it. All that good stuff. So there you go guys, let's start the video. Let's go. I'm the founder of 23 Whoa. different radical leftist organizations, Damn. including the Africans Fighting Racism and Oppression, or Afro, if you will, uh, the Black Revolutionary Organization, or BRO. Uh, yeah, sure. People tell me I look like Bill Cosby all the time. I mean, excuse me, oh, Dr. Bill Cosby, especially when I wear these sunglasses. Yeah, yeah, my name is Ronnie, son. But you know, you just call me AKA Ronnie Escobar, you know what I'm saying? Because I'll be in the streets, you know? I got okay. all kinds of names like HR Paper Stacks, uh, also known as AKA Horse Choker, uh, and also the Black Revolutionary Underground Heroes. Um, bro? Yeah, bro. AKA Pillsbury Doughboy, AKA Lewis Rich. Like the turkey bacon? Yeah, like the. So like I was saying, I've always believed that cosminess is natural godliness. So my granddad's wearing his Bill Cosby shades, and I'm like, this nigga look blonde. And then I thought, <laughs> oh, I got an idea. I know I'm going to get this money, and I'm going to take it. Hustling, 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 bro. Dear Sibby, my name is Riley Freeman. If my granddad has one weakness, it's bitchy. He's been a lonely man ever since he had a bleach fight on his first Whoa. and went blind. Mm. Mm. All he's got in this world is his car, Dorothy. The car is in pretty bad shape. And everyone knows that bitches don't really check for niggas will beat a car. That can't be Dorothy. Oh my god. That cannot be his car. Dorothy. He he probably got that from the junkyard, bro. Oh my god, what happened? Check inside the garage. I'm Robert Freeman's guy. I'm tired of dying in this Damn, he look, yo, he look extra ugly today, man. Yo, stop. <laughs> Damn, what's good with him? It's <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. yeah, something bad. <laughs> well, maybe if he had a nice little car, he might be able to get a date. And I have to pay for it. Please, you serious? So, man, tears. Please, you serious? Pay my ride for my grandfather for 9 11. Aww. For America. Man, tears. What's up, y'all? This is X to the Z exhibit, and we here at the house of Riley Freeman, and we're about to pay for his grandfather's car, George. As you can see, Dorothy is way past the prime. I mean, <laughs> look at the paint job. Word. Look like he needs lotion. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my why are we hiding? Word. If he comes out here and finds his favorite rapper and Zimba Bits and the Pimpin' Squad, he'll have a heart attack. For real? I'm his favorite rapper? Man, I love your whole catalog. But now, y'all got to get the hell. <laughs> They're sitting on the side of the car like, look at the cameraman and everything. <laughs> uh, great footage. I'm about to get him before he finds him. And I want some uh, 200 inch rims and, uh, uh, and I want five televisions. And I want to see the trunk. Oh! Oh! Ooh! Yeah, where you see a couple of strangers with your grandchildren and stuff? Like, yo! Oh! Damn! Dude, you got fucked up by that old ass man! Yeah! <laughs> Damn, calm down. Oh my goodness. Yeah. You could have a TV and a steering wheel. Boy, Dorothy isn't just a cop. I'd love to care for that vehicle for 30 years. 
Oh, this must be before Dorothy got an upgrade. Probably. Okay, okay. Let All us right. know in the in the comments below. Honestly. All right. I mean, let's see if it's true. <laughs> you think we'll let them damn rap before the goldfish in the dashboard? Oh, the goldfish, granddad. You two need your own sitcom. All you gotta do is get on TV with a soft story and people give you free stuff. I still ain't gonna lie to nobody. There's one thing I can't stand is lying. Don't fix your name. You ain't got to lie. I'll lie. Just play along. They gonna fix my transmission. Wow. Gentlemen, sorry about this I'm saying. Now, where's that boy? What's the name? Inhibit? Oh, <laughs> Inhibit. Walk, huh? Uh-oh, you ain't looking. There's one thing about you, when he get that look, bro, a lot of drama is about to happen, bro. Mm-hmm. Inhibit, we'll be coming soon. Oh, yeah, that's right. Inhibit, we'll be coming soon. Inhibit, we'll be coming soon. The tooth fairy takes away from his dollar under my pillow. A dollar? There's no such thing as a tooth fairy. Then who's leaving the money? Probably your parents. They have both the cash and the access to your room. Why did they lie to me? Because the truth hurts, Jasmine. The world is a hard and lonely place, and nobody gets anything for free. And you want to know what else? One day, you and everyone you know is going to die. Oh, that's a little bit man, too harsh there, bro. Real, at that age. Damn. Don't, oh my God, Jasmine, it's okay, Jasmine. It's okay. Sorry, man. Like, I feel sad. I like, know. <laughs> damn. <laughs> damn. Oh, you enjoy abusing people's illusions. I respect that. It's thankless work. He's back. Do you like my sunglasses? <laughs> I wear sunglasses because my idol, Dr. Bill Cosby, wears sunglasses all the time. And you know what they say. Cosbyness is next to godliness. Who are you? Nobody, really. Just thought you might want to talk to someone who understands. You don't know me. <laughs> I know you better than you think, you Freeman. Oh. Damn, where'd he go? It's not that I don't believe you, Huey. It's that I don't believe you, and I'm not interested. But, Glenn, you're being followed by a secret government agent. Ain't nobody following you. You just want attention. I bet Exhibit's gonna put, like, 30-inch rims on the car. 30 inches? Is that big? He knew he <laughs> about us, like, like, like the stupid Bill Cosby sunglasses thing. Well, these stupid sunglasses got us a new car. So you said the car stops and the wheels keep spinning? That's amazing. Yes, sir. All I'm saying is when Exhibit brings that car back, you gonna be bitches. What did you call me? No, oh. no, I'm bitches. Like, like you gonna have so many bitches, that's what niggas is gonna call you. No disrespect. No disrespect? You just called your grandfather bitches. <laughs> yeah, but I don't mean bitches in a disrespectful way. I mean it as a general word for women. And you're gonna let him get away with that? It's okay, just as once. Granddad, I'm just saying, you might have to change your middle name from Jebediah to bitches. That's all I'm trying to say. No disrespect. Riley's logic. <laughs> and the thing, the thing about Riley's logic, his grandfather always agreeing with it. Exactly. <laughs> Yo. Like, sometimes you may stop him, right, from thinking of what it is, but Riley will always have a reason for you to listen to him. Yeah, Granddad and Riley, bro, there's two, one of a kind. Got a nice thing to Shh. Did you hear that? What? What is it? I don't hear anything. It's Huey's make-believe government agent in our bathroom taking a dump. That's Uncle Ruckus, bro. This nigga got imaginary friends. <laughs> Damn. Good morning, Freeman family. What in the hell? <laughs> Mr. Freeman, I know you can't see us because you're blind, but we're from Extreme Makeover Home Edition, and we're going to build a new wing onto your house. Oh. Cut. Okay, okay let's do it again, people, and get a reverse angle from inside the house. 
Damn, he didn't even say go in now. I know. Riley. <laughs> what happened? Of course. You see? What's catch? Just keep pretending you blind. That's it? That's it. Oh, um, I, uh, might have, I maybe, uh, might have told him you was running a homeless shelter out here. Oh, man. I had to tell him something. Watch the bad people up top. You got to hit him with a big ass house already. Don't trip. We just find some people to act home. By the way, I told him to put in a grotto. A grotto? Yeah, like you have to got nobody got bitches like you have to, right? <laughs> you ain't never lied about that. <laughs> 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 I'm pretty. <laughs> That's their house. Think he's daydreaming. <laughs> Mr. Freeman, you have an amazing grotto. Please, Mr. Hefner. Call me bitches. Okay, Mr. Bitches. Uh... The homeless people are needed in makeup. Huh? The homeless people? This is a homeless shelter, right? We assumed there'd be homeless people. Uh... If they was here all the time, they wouldn't be homeless, would they? It's a shelter, not a prison. Be! Little bastard. Uh, oh. excuse me. Bitches? Uh, I've actually seen this show. They're gonna demolish the house. Hello? Do you hear me? Come on, let's find some homeless people. I mean, he already, they already took down a yeah. piece of wall, so it's like, you might as well go for it, bro. You cannot put it back. Oh. She made as hell. I know. Whoa. Go away. B. Shoot. Hey there, Huey. I found this little homeless girl. And I know how your grandfather loves to take care of homeless people. What the hell are you doing here? Your brother called, said if I'd bring Jasmine over, I could sing on the show. Hi, I'm Tom. I live across the street. I'm a lawyer by day, but... Whoop, whoop, up here. <laughs> there you go. So, like I was saying, my true passion is singing. A heart is a house of love. He's not bad at singing, man. Yeah. I'll tell you what. If your granddad has one weakness, oh. it's bitches. Of course, they're my weakness, too. What do you want with me? It's complicated, Huey. Uh, I'm a secret agent sent to spy on you. Okay. So you're not Maybe it's not that complicated. It's, it's not. not done. It's finished. Do spies normally introduce themselves to people they spy on? What spy school did you go to? Eh, I'm too old to be sneaking around. Excuse us, coming through. What if I tell someone right now? You tried that earlier in the kitchen, remember? By the way, I wasn't really in the bathroom taking a dump, but man. <laughs> oh, that brother of yours is a hoot. And your grandfather? Those two need their own sitcom. Leave me alone. Yeah. Oh, wow. Just because my job is to watch your every move and eavesdrop on every telephone call and monitor your every email doesn't mean we can't be friends. That's nuts. Where'd he go? He's following the box? Yo, it's suspicious. Excuse me, did you notice me talking to someone a second ago right here, dressed like y'all? Wasn't really looking. Sorry. Where are we putting the fried chicken? Ask the, ask the guy that the we'll pass out. Yeah, the yeah. boxes. Yes, sir. I mean, everything we see is a false reality. It's like Big Brother, The Matrix, whatever you want to call it. While we're watching each other, they're watching us. Red pill or blue pill? Some of you may be wondering why we're renovating the Freeman house when it's already so big. Well, it turns out that Robert Freeman, who is blind, has run a homeless shelter out of his house for years. Wow. No. Yes, sir, I've been living with the Freeman for three months now. They the cleanest color folks you ever did see. My mother, um, <laughs> used crack? She used crack. She left me in a dumpster, and you should get Rodney a movie theater. <laughs> <laughs> what? 
Excuse me, Mr. Bitches. We have some release paperwork for you to sign. Hold on. Read first. Let me read it first. Mm-hmm. Ah, uh, joke. <laughs> yeah, good, good one. one. Good one. one. Now, just, just sign here and there. Great. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Thanks. What is that? Oh, oh, I'm so yo, I'm suing, bro. <laughs> you don't know what's in there. Oh. But I'm still suing. <laughs> um, yeah. Because of you, Riley. I'm just kidding. What's the matter? You wouldn't understand. <laughs> You're thinking in personal, bro. <laughs> I'm being shadowed by a secret agent. Really? Where is he? I don't know. Kind of just pops up out of nowhere and then disappears. You mean like the Tooth Fairy? No, I don't mean like the Tooth Fairy. Sounds like the Tooth Fairy to me. You can believe in secret agents and I can't believe in the Tooth Fairy? That's messed up. Okay. Eat something out of a dumpster, you street urchin. Oh. <laughs> I should never have let you talk me into this. First you let my Zima take my car away, now I'm just fighting people out to the store in my house! Yeah. 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 All we gotta do is keep up the act. We gonna have a new car and a new house. Get away out. All because we didn't listen to Huey. Excuse me, uh, Mr. Bitches, I think your car just showed up. Dorothy! When we first saw Dorothy, the only thing that worked was the off switch. That car was so old, it ran an unleaded coat. But take a look at the new Dorothy. Okay. 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 Yeah. But he can't see So you're not lying? How are you seeing this, bro? Next with exhibit. 
bastard. Damn. All right, here's the invoice, and take your time with that. Looks like money gonna be tight around here for a minute. <laughs> she does look nice. All things considered, I say we came out of here. No. No, bruh. Oh, they're about to get the boat. <laughs> you see? I'll come up with a name for you. The White Shadow. Hmm. I'm white. I am shadowing you. It's very clever. And I've decided that you're a figment of my overactive imagination. Now who's hiding from reality? Just because you're paranoid, Huey, doesn't mean we're not out to get you. If you are real, why me? No. Come on. You underestimate yourself. It's a shame what happened to the house. You warned them. They wouldn't listen to me. Oh, yeah. They never listen to me. I know Facts. how to save the world, Shuri. But sometimes people have to learn lessons on their own. Mm -hmm. The hard way. True. Well, can't miss the idol. If you ever want to talk, remember, I'm always listening. Damn, that's tough. Obi-Wan Kenobi said, your eyes can deceive you. Don't mm. trust them. Mm. It seems to be getting harder. Distinguishing reality from the illusions people make for us. Mm. From the ones we make for ourselves. I don't know. Maybe that's part of the plan. To make me think I'm crazy. <laughs> hey, look at the, the fire. I don't know. Working. Anybody want to drink out the fridge? Want an espresso? I mean, at least they're Yeah, cars. at least the car is still. Good night, Granddad. Well, good, good night. Good night, Huey. Uh, good, good night. Good night, Riley. Good night, Huey's imaginary secret agent friend. <laughs> Granddad, Huey's imaginary friend tried to touch me in a private place. Whoa! <laughs> And he's laughing. Well, with that finishing statement, we have nothing else to say. Mm -mm. Guys, thank you so much for watching the, our reaction to the Boondocks The Real. Guys, if we don't upload some of the Boondocks episode, it's because it's getting copyrighted. So bear with us, please. And also give this video a thumbs up. And like my girl always says... Don't forget to smash the like button, subscribe to our channel, and turn on the notification button. And we see you guys next time. Peace! Peace.